toughest trophy in all of sports to win. Two great teams competed for it. Congratulations to the Blackhawks and their fans. And the celebration is on in the Windy City. In studio, we have a, a Stanley Cup champion. I don't know how many Stanley Cup champions have been here. I'm, my guess is I'm going to say zero. Um, so thank you for being the first, and thank you for coming down, yeah, Chris. Great to be here. I want to take it back to, to game six. Chicago, you guys are in Philadelphia. How many people did you have attending the game? I had four people. Um, I couldn't get all the family members I wanted out there, but I had my two brothers, Mitch and Bryce, obviously. Uh, some people have seen them already in the past. Yeah. <laughs> my father, if he even remembered the game. And uh, I had my girlfriend out too, so uh, they were all out there and they were having a good time. I remember when your pops fake sprayed me. He was like, gonna spray yeah. me and I, had to, I always have to be aware when I'm around it. You gotta be the aware. The prestige, yeah. Especially Roy, yeah. He actually had golf tees uh, put away in all his, uh, his socks and everything because he didn't know how those Philly fans were gonna act, so he had a little weapon here and there <laughs> if uh, anything happened. It's actually a true story. Really? He did bring golf tees, yeah. Dude, your dad is like very old school. Yeah, like he it's, is. It's like, it's like you got the, the <laughs> yeah. golf tees and the socks and then brass knuckles. Yeah, like, he, had some, he, he was ready to go. Nice. I want you to set the scene for me. And now it's in the net, they score! It's, it's it, they score! It's it! it! The Hawks win it's the it! Stanley Cup! The Hawks win the Stanley Cup! Patrick scores the goal, and you guys jump on the ice and you celebrate on the ice. But then now, now take us into the dressing room because the audience doesn't really get to see what happens in the dressing room like right away. Later they do, but like right away what happens. I remember the first thing when I got down the tunnel was you. <laughs> and uh, you, had the, you had the super soaker already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we were filling that baby up with some champagne. And I remember filling it up and walking in and spraying everybody. And getting in there, and, and the first thing I wanted to see when I got in that room was the cup. And, Sure enough, all the guys had it in the back corner, and we're all uh, all up standing there. And the one song that was on was "All I Do Is Win" by uh, T Pain. And, oh, and I, DJ Khaled. And DJ that was, Khaled. That, was playing that in the, is in the, the room? best song. All I do is win, 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 no matter what. Got money on my mind, I can never get enough. And every time I step up in the building, everybody hands go up. Every bar we walked into in Chicago, every restaurant, anything, that was the one song they played. And that was the first song I remember walking into the dressing room when they were playing. And all the boys are, you put your hands up yeah. and we're all doing it. And and they stayed there. Yeah. And they stayed there. <laughs> it was a good time. Hosa wasn't even drinking the champagne. He was just telling us to pour it on him. So we were just pouring the champagne <laughs> all over him. I know you're, you're a big fan of like the no shirts party. That's like, what's the line that you have with your friends at, at back in Lethbridge? MHSOC, baby. <laughs> Smash that sleeve off, you club. That's how we do. On that night, um, there were. Uh, uh, when did you? When did you take your your? Oh yeah, here we go. So when did you? <laughs> when did this happen? I actually don't really remember, but uh, I'm sure there was a, a good reason why my shirt was off. You have uh, your name on the Stanley Cup, and, and uh, there's a there's a spelling mistake. What's what's happened since then? They actually changed it, but if you look at like a, a picture, kind of looks. My name is the last name on the cup. And it's pretty it goes funny. In it goes it's in alphabetical, alphabetical order. Yeah, order. And my name is the last name on the cup, and it's so bold, and it's just like it's almost embarrassing, kind of. But it, it is. It's still really cool. But uh, it uh, they punched over. I think all the instead of just punching over the two letters, they screwed up. I think they punched over the full name now. So it, it, it it's hard to see unless you really look at it now. But it is a little bolder than it was before. So there is one, like I said, one camera angle where it's kind of funny to look at. But if you're just looking at it, um, I guess right in front of you, you're not going to be able to really tell. 